Hey fam, Chi Chi here. Welcome back. It is that time of the year. My favorite time of the year. It is Black History Month. So all month long, I'm going to be showcasing black designers, black perfumers, black creators, all black everything on this channel. I did this last year and I had so much fun just, you know, putting together things and stuff like that. So I just wanted to, you know, run it back for this year. But if you're new here, hey, I'm Chi Chi and I talk about all things lavish, but logical. So if that's your sort of thing, go ahead, subscribe, make some friends in the comment section and follow me on Instagram and TikTok. I just want to uh, talk about the elephant that's in the room. You may not even notice it, but thank you guys for all your well wishes. Um, I ended up in the hospital, long story short, I bit my tongue, all of my entire jaw internally is inflamed <laughs> and swollen. So um, if you see any extra swelling up in the, you know, chin area, or uh, some of my words are a little bit slurred or wispy, it's because I'm trying not to <laughs> uh, reactivate whatever is going on. Um, but yeah, it's, it's really painful. I'm in pain right now, but I have to thug it out because it's Black History Month. The show must go on. So I'm thugging it out. So thank you for, you know, just thugging it out with me. But enough about that. We're here for this. We're doing an unboxing and it comes from none other than Vavoon. I have mentioned Vavoon on this channel last year. I really was excited about this brand because it is a black woman owned brand. Okay, the founder and owner of Vavoon is none other than Valerie Blaze. She has been around for a while with this brand and I absolutely love it. She's had a collection with Christian Siriano of, you know, Project Runway fame. So, you know, she's somebody on the streets just, it's, you know, it's between us right now. She's not all the way popping, but I really do like her bags and she's one of the few people who actually makes her bags. Now, I don't know if it's just the one bag and then she mass produces it or, you know, she's got DNA on all of these bags. But anyway, we have yet another unboxing. I did an unboxing last year. Quick update with that bag. As much as I liked it, I had to return it. However, when I purchased that bag, I got it from Nordstrom. However, they had it stored. The handle that had the glazing on it was stuck to the front of the bag. So that is no indication of this, the actual brand. So um, yeah, I was really disappointed that I had to return that bag, but I was like, I'm going to get me another Vavoom bag. And this one popped up. Now, <laughs> I don't know why I can't seem to like purchase from the site because I want the whole experience. So the bag that I wanted, unfortunately, the color that I wanted was only at Nordstrom. So I don't have the full experience of the Vavoon packaging. You know, at the end of the day, I'm still supporting the brand. My next bag will definitely be directly from the site because Nordstrom is cool, but I just, I just want the experience. So I wanted a bag for spring. And when I saw this bag, I was like, I think this is meeting my needs. So we have the EFA bag, E-F-A. Now it's white. You're like, girl, you're getting a white bag? Absolutely. freaking lutely I wanted a white bag in my collection. I've just been in a place in my collection where I'm like, okay, I want a little bit more fun, a little bit more color. So I have been on the hunt for a white bag. I saw this one pop up and I was so upset that this was a Nordstrom only color. So um, I did go on Nordstrom. I did save a little bit of money on top of that, but <sighs> this bag is so freaking nice. It's like a little boat. Okay, let's take the tour of it. So we have a rolled top handle. There is no extra like crossbody along 
um, straps or whatever. So I already knew that going into it. Then we have this cute Vavon ring. And if you look throughout her bags, most of them have some sort of a ring detail. So this one, you know, it goes jingling, jangling, left to right, however you wanna wear it. But I, I like that little detail. Is it something a little different, something distinguishable for the brand? And then we have the brand name in gold foil at the right corner. And then there are no feet. Now, one thing that I didn't realize when looking at this bag, I thought these two little pleats on either side of the bag would open almost like a pocket and unfortunately it's sewn down so i was like i wish this kind of was a little bit of a pocket but it's fine i'm still rock it so we have gold hardware avi and a very 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 smooth zipper i love a good zip okay so that was giving me Louis Vuitton vibes right there on the zip alone. Look at that, not a single catch. That part <laughs> was worth the money for this bag. So, okay, we just have a little bit of packing and then inside of the bag, it looks like linen, cotton linen inside. And then we have a leather um, pocket right here. There's no branding inside of the bag. So it's a very, very simple bag. And that's exactly what I wanted for the summer. I'm getting out of my comfort zone of, you know, just having shoulder bags or crossbody bags. You know, sometimes I do want to do a little top, mo you know, top handle moment. And I figured because this is white and, you know, I could jazz it up really nicely. Um, I thought it was just really really cute it's very interesting to look at in my opinion I, I really do like it i'm noticing that when i do go for small bags i like a bag that is long so i can fit my phone i have the samsung galaxy s22 ultra so i'm able to fit that in here i'm not gonna do a what fits in this bag yet you know because it's gotta wear it a little bit more but this bag is it's just really cute. Like you're not gonna sit here and tell me it's not cute. I, I know my lights are blowing it out. It almost looks like either a boat or like the bottom part of, of, it, of a lip. <laughs> so um, I guess it's pretty fitting <laughs> given my, uh, my little situation. But even from like this angle without the, the handle, it, it gives me lips vibes which I, I'm here for it. But I did get this from Nordstrom for a really good deal, but I still wanna purchase directly from the site. Like I am determined to get a bag directly from them because I really want to see the packaging and, you know, really experience the brand. You know, it's one thing where, you know, you order from like a department store, but I want the experience. But yeah, this is my new baby. I'm so excited for spring and summer to really break this out because like who doesn't want like a cute little fun white bag? Like I think it's gonna be absolutely gorgeous. And yeah, newest addition to the family. And it's black owned and it's woman owned. Check, 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 check. So if you wanna see the original bag that I picked up from Vavoon last year, I'm gonna leave that video bong bong up top and I will catch you in the next one. Bye guys.